All right, travel costs are going up, and experts aren't predicting a decrease anytime soon. Bummer. And now a possible bidding war over discount carrier Spirit Airlines, which also doesn't mean good news for us customers. Heather Mills explains. Spirit is known as the no frills airline cheap tickets, where you pay a la carte for things like bags, including carry ons and even snacks. A merger would mean higher costs for everyone. And historically, we've seen when airlines merge, prices do go up for consumers. Right now, it's a battle for Spirit Airlines. Both Frontier and JetBlue vying to buy the low cost carrier for billions. Clint Henderson with the Point Sky says. Get ready to dig deeper into your pockets if a spirit merger happens. You're going to have less competition in the space, and that usually means higher ticket prices. Probably not great news for consumers, net net, but there's a chance it might not even get approved, even neither one of these mergers. But if there is a winner, you're looking at two partnerships with very different end results. They will be two different beasts. If it's a if it's a frontier merger, it's going after budget travelers. If it's a JetBlue merger, it's more business travelers and higher end consumers. Either merger could create the nation's fifth largest airline, creating less competition in the market, which is where the Justice Department and antitrust regulators could step in. If you're eliminating the cheapest route, the cheapest tickets available in the market, all of a sudden, not only is that bargain basement fare gone, but the other airlines can also raise their prices because if they're not competing against Spirit, they can raise prices even higher. And as far as destinations go, Frontier offers a lot of routes on the West Coast. So combining with Spirit's network along the East Coast and the Caribbean, it would expand its portfolio. JetBlue's strength on the East Coast, including Florida, would mean much more overlap with Spirit. One of the big takeaways for consumers, the concern that the merger would eliminate the cheap airfare that Spirit is known for at a time when experts say ticket prices are already going up about 7% a month. Heather Mills, live, local, now.